Spotted off San Diego's coast this week, a massive mola mola fish, also known as a sunfish. If you're not familiar, it looks like this. Some describe it as goofy looking, incredibly odd. Mm -hmm. Might want to move away from it. But as our tenders reporter Amanda Brandeis explains, for the group that encountered this fish, it felt like hitting the ocean lottery. Two or three trips a day, it's been pretty busy. Typically when we meet up with Correct. Dominic Biagini, it's because of his breathtaking whale footage. He's the owner and captain of Gone Whale Watching San Diego. We really specialize in giving people um, those once in a lifetime encounters. But that special encounter may not always be a whale. Whenever I give my opening spiel, I always tell people I'll show them anything that moves, uh, including a fish. For one group, this guy or girl stole the show. A massive mola mola fish, the world's largest bony fish. That's a face only a mother could love. It kind of looks like a giant fish head with fins. And while relatively common here, Biagini has never seen one this large in Southern California. We just drifted there with the engine off as this giant, I mean, it had to be seven to eight feet um, in diameter, which was, which was just a massive, massive fish. Close enough for the perfect selfie. On this trip, Biagini had divers on board. For them, the large docile fish is a prized animal to swim with. It was like we hit the lottery. It was my equivalent of finding killer whales, apparently. A lot is unknown about the mola, but the females can release 300 million eggs. And while usually spotted drifting in the water and basking in the sun, researchers recently discovered they're actually strong swimmers, albeit funny looking. Um, they kind of look like floating pancakes on the surface. Amanda Brandeis. 10 News. Jenny says the mola mola doesn't have any many natural predators, but one of their biggest threats is mylar balloons. Once uh, in the ocean, color chips off the balloon, making it look like a jellyfish, which is important mola food source. Jenny says if you're going to celebrate with balloons, please dispose of them properly.